everybody. Uh, okay, now, today is going to be slightly different. I, I had an idea in my head, like I always do, right, about what I'm going to have for dinner. And I, I went out and got some uh, reggae reggae sauce. Jerk BBQ. Oh, Christ. I didn't realise this is that two out of three peppers on the strength. I didn't know that. Oh, boy. Uh, it's only just now I've noticed it, but anyway, I, I bought this because I had in mind I'm going to do a special dish, and this was going to be uh, not, not a marinade. It's going to be sort of like a seasoning. You throw it in, and it's going to, uh, you know, it, it, it enhance the the flavour, turn it into a sort of a barbecue flavour. I had that in my head, right? And then I go into the co-op, and I'm, I'm looking at stuff. I'm looking at the mints. The mints isn't quite reduced as much as I want it to be, so I'm looking around. And then what happens? <laughs> I I come across the hot cabinet again. Now I know what are you thinking. You're thinking right. Well, we saw this video last week, right? The walls all day sausage breakfast. It's like a sausage in a. Well, there you go. It's a sausage in one of these rolls. Okay. Uh, I, I did have this last week, and I can't remember what I paid for it. I might, I might have been a quid, I don't know. Uh, have, a, have a look. Anyway. Um, but, normally they're priced at... Normally they're priced at £2. Okay, but I, but I got this because it's uh, it was shortly over, you know, um, the, the, date to be, the time to be used, and I got it for 50 pence. So... I bought three of them, right? I bought the last three. And so, um, yeah, I mean, it, 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 it's just too much of a bargain to pass up 50p for one of these. It's down from two quid down to 50p. So that's why I'm doing this instead of what I originally was planning on doing. And, uh, but, but yeah, I mean, you know, every day plans change. I've got a whole bunch of stuff that I want to um, make. I mean, this, this one's going to be really good. The, 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 the thing I had in mind. Okay, um, but I'll, I'll do that tomorrow, or, you know. Anyway, it's going to be involving the reggae, reggae sauce and uh, a bunch of ingredients. Anyway, so, um, yeah, so what, but what I'm going to do, and what I'm going to, I'll make the, I'll, you know, because you've already seen one with, involving this sausage in a roll, uh, I'm going to, you know, do a few variants on it. What I'm going to do is, I'm not going to put this in the oven like I did last time. I had a... I watched the, the video back and I was amazed at just how crunchy, I mean I was standing over here eating the thing and I, the, the, the camera really picked up the crunchiness because it was in the oven and, and um, quite a few people at work today commented how crunchy the bread was. Um, anyway, so what I'm going to do, I'm not going to put it in the oven, what I am going to do is put the sausage in the microwave for uh, 30 seconds or a minute, I don't know. Um, so, so the sausage will be hot. Now, what I've done, what I've done in this little frying pan I have, a tiny, is a, you know, this is what I do the um, if I do a single egg, I do it in the frying pan here, and it's also good for onion rings. So I'm doing onion rings with a sausage with reggae reggae sauce, and literally 30 seconds before I turn the camera on, I actually got, um, I, I pulled out a couple of gherkins from my from my jar, pound thirty nine these, 680 grams, or well, drained weight, 370. Blimey, that's like 300 grams in water. Good. Um, anyway, so I've got a couple of those sliced up, so I'm going to put those in there. Okay, uh, right, so everything's, right, I'm going to put the sausage in the microwave and yeah, put that in there that'll uh, heat up meantime meantime I'm gonna be I'm gonna put some reggae reggae in the in the uh, right I'll tell you I don't know ah oh, Jesus. okay well that's quite a lot of reggae reggae sauce That's the thing. What they, I don't know if they do these in a squeezy bottle. They ought to because um, it's, it's hard to regulate. I mean, yeah, because I've got quite a bit of... Uh, I mean, this is going to... According to that, it's two out of three peppers on the scale. Anyway. Ugh. Okay, so, uh, yeah, you can see that. Now what I'm going to do... 
I'm going to place the gherkins along the length of the bread. There. There you go. So it's looking looking pretty good. Now, what I'm going to do? Oh, right. That's the sausage. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to, I'm going to sprinkle the onion in there. This is looking pretty good. I like to have the onion a bit brown. If I ever have onions at a burger van, which is rare that I'll eat at a burger van, especially nowadays, I always have the onions. I always try and get them a bit extra, extra done. Okay, so actually, I'm not even sure I'm going to get the sausage in here now. Right. Uh, okay, so we got the we got the reggae reggae sauce, two gherkins in there, a bunch of frozen. These are frozen onions. Okay. Let's see. Right, you can see that. Okay, now these are frozen onions. Okay, now the sausage. That over there. Okay, I might. Uh, where's my knife? I might cut it in. Oh, I forgot to turn the uh, oven off. The cooker off. Right, I'll cut it in half, I think. Make it easier to handle. Yeah. I tell you, that's the thing. <laughs> You can take a, you can take an average sausage roll, a shop sausage roll, and you can turn it into something really special. With, I mean, the, the, basically, this comes in is a roll with a sausage, right? The sausages are good. You can, I don't know if you can see there, you can see the herbs and stuff in the sausages, but with the addition of some flavoursome sauce, some gherkin for for crunch, and some onion for for the hell of it, you know. Okay. Now, yeah, this is uh, so. Yeah, you, you know, I mean, the, the 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 whole thing. So you're looking at what uh, fifty p for the for the bun and the sausage, gherkins a bugger all the one thirty nine for a big jar of them reggae reggae sauce one sixty nine. Take a splash of that. Onion for taste, that's for certain. I uh, did put a lot in there. Mm. I like this bread. They do you, the bread is chewy, especially when it gets heated up. There's gherkins coming out of the end there. Yeah. Yeah, oh boy. <laughs> this, oh Christ. Yeah, this sauce is hot. That'll teach me that. That'll teach me to pay attention in the shop. I saw the reggae, reggae. Well, right. Oh boy. Yeah, two out of three on the. Uh, oh boy. But I'll use it as a marinade in my other dish that I was going planning on doing. But yeah, if you're not big on now. Uh, Spicy stuff, pay attention to uh, the label when you buy that. Uh, but uh, yeah, it's actually, you know, the, the sausages are really good quality sausages, as, it, as they, you know, they always are when they, um, they, they use the good ones in here. Hmm. And that, let me, uh, that is how you jazz up. It's, they call it an all-day breakfast, but uh, basically it's, it's a sausage in a in a roll. I think it, to, to be to be an all-day breakfast, it's got to have uh, you know something else in it, some egg or something. But yeah. But if you if you do you know from down from two pound down to fifty p, so I'm gonna be eating all three tonight for my dinner. And I'm gonna try try some different variants in it. But yeah, so if you oh, so if you do get a chance, you know, pick them up and 
and that's how you jazz it up. That's that's just a few ideas. I mean, I I um I, I've used onions and I've used gherkins. You can put cheese in there. You can put um, you know, I don't know anything you like any kind of sauce as well. Maybe one that's not quite so hot. But uh, but yeah, I'm going to be enjoying this tonight, and that's what I'll be doing. Thanks very much for watching. Bye bye.